welcome back to our channel guys if you are new here it's good to have you here subscribe for the vibes if you are not new here welcome back all right it's a breakfast um, I re we really do breakfast so I went to McDonald's I got what is this I've never had sandwich uh, sausage McMuffin sausage egg McMuffin I think McDonald's got my order wrong. I didn't even look look in the bag. Anyway, we're gonna make it work. Look, <clears throat> so I'm gonna do it. It's both the same thing. So, but this one have egg and cheese. This one have sausage and cheese. Eesh. All right, guys, I'm gonna get into it. So, look, while I'm doing the review on the sandwiches, we're gonna talk about do your spouse make you better. You know the song, I'm a movement by myself, but I'm a force when we're together. Baby, I'm good all by myself, but baby, you, you make me better. <laughs> so, alright, this is the egg and sausage McMuffin with cheese. Alright. Think about it, is. Even though I put it in the microwave, it's still cold. Nobody take pride in their food anymore. It's okay though. It's dry. It's really dry. I'm not sure I'm gonna enjoy it, but <clears throat> I have an ice cream here. I have some sauce down here. It's not really sauce, it's just ketchup and mayo. Does your spouse make you better? If you're dating someone, does it matter if they make you better or worse? For me, you have to make me better. It's a must. You can't go around it. And so that's to make you better, does your spouse give you advice that go in the favor of them? Like giving you advice that's not good for you at all and you know it's not good for you but you're still listening like this mother. Do they make your relationship? with your parents better, your relationship with your kids better, if, the, if you don't share kids with them, you know. Do they make your relationship with your friends, with, with your friends better? Or, they make it worse. Because, you know, I'm getting ready to talk. You're probably good with the, the, the ketchup and the mayo. Because you know, when spouse don't like your friends, they give you the worst advice about them. Like the worst. When they don't like your parents, they give you the worst advice. They don't tell you, if you're in an argument with someone like, hey, work it out. Some spouses are happy <laughs> that there's an argument because then they'd be like at least the friend will leave at least your mom and your dad will barely call you and I could have you for myself <laughs> I think if you're dating someone they sh they're supposed to make you better no you're supposed to make yourself better first but if you're dating someone, they're supposed to contribute to your better, better, you know? You can tell I'd rather the ash brown more than the sandwich, but I'm going to taste this one. I don't like, uh, this is okay, but it's dry, like, put, put, put some sauce on it or something, you know? Now, when your spouse can't contribute to your better, <laughs> It's a reflection of who they are. 
if you're dating a mean spouse and you're not mentally strong, you're going to be mean too. Fact, if you're mentally strong, it's different. But if you're not, you're going to take on their personality because they're going to pressure you to take on their personality, which is not your personality, but you're going to take it on anyway because you're going to think that you're in love. You're like, oh, I love him or her, so let me just do it. No. No. <laughs> We know when someone is making us better. I know that Jay made me way better than who I am. Oh my, it, it's, 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 it's extraordinary. She contributes to my cool, my charm, my charisma, you know. I used to date someone once. <laughs> Never wanted my kid around. That was a red flag. No, that was a big old red flag, right? No, but at the end of the day, you know, I'm going to be like, you're in love, you know, we, we see past everything. No. They're supposed to want your kids around, even though it's not their kids. They're supposed to want your kids around. They're supposed to want, if you have a bad relationship with your kids, they're supposed to want to help you build a good relationship with your, your kid. That's a great spouse. Mm. Okay, so this is right too, but it tastes better than the one with the egg. This have no egg in it, it's just cheese. Oh my, look at this. It's just, <laughs> it's just cheese and um, sausage. <clears throat> I'm happy I have the orange juice if I were to choke on camera. So if you, have, if you, if you ever think about it, Oh my, I could use this as a rock and hit somebody. It's crazy. So what do you think? Does your spouse make you better if you're in a relationship? Or they make you worse? You, you know, you know, you, you know. Don't pretend like you know, you know. We always see the red, red flags. We always ignore them. It's either we ignore them because we love the person. We're trying to change the person. You are who you are. If you're mean, you're just mean. No. <laughs> this, this is not my best meal. Um, reasons I don't really eat McDonald's breakfast. Especially the, the sandwiches. You have to put some pride in your food, you know? You need some love. Look at this. If, if you guys could see how dry this is to go in somebody's belly. I'm only eating it because I'm sitting with you guys and it's disrespectful. You know? <laughs> So if you're aware that your spouse is not making you better, you know they try to sabotage, they, they try to sabotage you. you. You have some spouse that's, that do that. What would you do? Would you leave or would you be like, they're going to change and I love them, you know. Mm. What would you do? I had a few that didn't make me better. I stayed out of love. Yeah, we always stay out of love. But in the end of it all, you do realize that, yo, you're no good for me. You, you made me not, not, not a better person. You know, I'm now I'm just like you. I'm going to take the sausage out. And I'm gonna eat the sausage because the the um oh my the sausage itself is dry too. Look at this guys. Let 
No, I'm not bashing the, the, the people that love McDonald's breakfast and stuff, you know. But this is torture. It's like you kidnap somebody, held them in the dungeon, tie them up, and this is the only thing they have to eat without no water. They're already dead. Yeah, it not make no sense. All right, guys. This was not my best meal. It wasn't my best meal. I'm not going to lie about it. I'm not going to about it. It wasn't my best meal. So next time I won't get this. <laughs> All right, guys. So think about it. Do you suppose make it better or worse? Because we are movement by ourselves, but we're a force when we're with somebody that makes us better. All right, guys. So I hope you enjoy this breakfast with me. Um, yeah, I hope you enjoy this breakfast with me. I hope you enjoy the conversation. This is where I leave you until I meet you again, until I see you again. Have a good time, a fine time, a jolly time. Hey, guys, put laughter in your life. It will light it up. Bye, guys.